Yeah, what is going on everybody stiff and we're back on the Mad ultimate team 16 coin games and today We got the epic rematch between dub dot w and myself the last uh, Coin wager that we did it was against dub dot w came out came down to be a very good matchup We pulled away with the victory if you guys have not seen that video. I recommend watching it He is a very good tournament player almost made it down to Burbank, California for the Madden challenge for draft champions And now we got the rematch he wanted to re-it up for another 100k now if you guys want to play me in a wager match make sure you guys message me on my gamer tag stiffmeister12 it will be in the description and in the comments below and if you guys are new make sure you guys like comment and subscribe so here we go first play of the game we already ran three four even the first game and we we you know we, we stopped them uh, pretty good we mixed it in and then the first play from scrimmage we run three four even i knew this was going to be happening put the corner in a light blue he put him in a streak and he bombs us for six very easy very easy six points very easy read and that's how the cookie's gonna crumble that's how the, that's how the game's gonna start off so let's see if we can um, let's see if we can combat that and put together a drive of our own as we throw across our body going and running uh, throwing on the run Cunningham just put it right on the dime probably a terrible read on my part but right here second and ten we find an Odell Beckham jr. wide open and people like to get really adjusty on my offense sometimes and they leave that that streak wide open uh, don't ask me why it just happens so anyway on the next possession by Dubby he uh, is go we're, we're trying to actually be a little bit more careful this time and not give up one play touchdowns because that's you know that's not what you want to do in life <laughs> especially in this game so we're starting to mix in three four even we're starting to mix in some man coverage starting to mix in some cover three just mixing in our coverages and that's probably the best hint I can give anybody in this game is mix up your coverages don't just run one single coverage cover three blitz all single game mix it up cover two man coverage single coverage do all that and right here first and ten we make the proper adjustment we went three four even but this time we manned up our safety on the wide receiver we knew he was going to put on a streak we made the correct adjustment it was good defense he just aggressive catched on us and there's really nothing we could do there it sucks that when you make a proper adjustment it doesn't pay off sometimes in the game but that's the way you you have to live life on Madden Ultimate Team 16. But anyway, on our next possession, we end up getting in with Bo Jackson rumbling, stumbling his way into the end zone. Now, if you guys are wondering if I'm feeling okay, I am getting better. I feel good. I made it through. I'm not dying, so that that's that's pretty good. I'll be pumping out more videos for you guys. So if you guys were hoping I was on my deathbed, I'm sorry, but I'm not. <laughs> so anyway, second and 13, we get a key sack, but then he hits us with a one-play touchdown glitch. He glitched out one of our zones. It's uh, one of the route combinations he had on the field. Very good play on his part and ends up scoring very quickly. But that does not mean to say we're not going to throw super dots to Amari Cooper on the right sideline. Ooh, Randall Cunningham have a day throwing super darts. And then right here, wide open Amari Cooper again. If it's not the streak you got to worry about, it's that corner route you got to worry about. That play is very, very tough. I like running that play a lot, especially when you're running 3-4 even. It's very hard um, to stop. So right before half, we got 24 seconds left. He's trying to combat something. Woohoo! We get a little block shed from Michael Strahan, who I actually got rid of. Uh, recently because the new Vaughn has a hundred finesse move. I think he's a little, just a little bit more versatile So anyway fourth and 16 he ends up punting and why am I showing a punt? Because of that and Taylor makes a game-saving tackle Right before he scores because if he was not there he goes in for six and we are absolutely screwed It's supposed to be 21 21. I was calling fair catch, but I called it at the last second that's on me. Those three points are on me. Let's see if it comes back to bite us in the ass. Hopefully it does not. That's one of those plays that can come back and really kick you right in the ass if uh, you do not play properly in the second half. So let's see what we're going to be doing. We're just running a lot of fullback insides with Bo Jackson. He's having a tough time stopping. If he's having a tough time, we are going to keep doing it. And right here we make a stupid read. Should have threw to him uh, sooner than that. Should have been picked off. Fourth and ten, we come back and we throw a super dart to OBJ. And we end up getting the first down. So we are get a clean set of first downs. Uh, clean set of downs, I should say. And we're just pounding the ball, pounding the ball. Make him respect this fullback inside until he stops. And look at Bo Jackson. Oh, almost gets goes all the way. Doesn't go all the way. 
uh, but ends up getting tripped up and we're gonna be taking off with Randall Cunningham is this is a really good chess match because we're making adjustments he's making adjustments to uh, to counter reduce my adjustments and then I'm trying to make adjustments to his extra adjustments. it's it's literally a game of chess if you think about it right here we actually had the speed out we get a little lucky we throw to uh, a playmaker Walter Payton we get around the edge and we get in for six and we go up four which is very critical <laughs> <laughs> they just paid back W huge. That's Deion Sanders. One of the reasons why I got Deion Sanders. He has 90 catch. 90 catch my ass. 90 catch my ass. He should have been. That's a pick six right there. And he just dropped it. He like floated it in there. Don't know how he dropped it. I got rid of his ass. Three million. Thank you. Give me that. <laughs> so anyway, uh, as we try and um, stop him now, it's, it's getting it's getting harder and harder, and the game is coming down to the line. He's he has he pretty much has a bunch of my zones and my man coverage uh, dotted up. He, he's got his reads on point right now. It's hard stopping him, and it's going to be even harder stopping this because now he's going to go up three with only a minute remaining. So. All I really need to do, I got three timeouts. I have plenty of time to come back. But what I'm basically going to do is I see single high coverage. I have Brian Finneran. I'm throwing it up. And you already know we are getting it with Brian Finneran. One-on-one matchup against anybody. I'll take that any day. I got v -Jack and I got Finneran. I'll take those guys one-on-one -on -one any day with any safety in the league. Even Sean Taylor. Sean Taylor is a little bit of a you know hiccup. He could actually pick that off because he's like 6'3". But anybody else... I'll lob that shit up one-on-one -on -one because I got the big receivers to do it. So anyway, as you guys can see, we go into OT. OT is where the heart bleeds. I don't know what I just said. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with it, though. <laughs> this is where crunch time, this is where men are made. He ends up winning the toss, and he gets ball first. Let's see if we can stop him. First play, he runs to the right. We get a pretty good gain, but we stop him pretty well. Second and five, he tries running again. We get a good block shed by Rod Woodson. So it's going to be third and three right around. We're just going to call uh, a cover three base stock coverage. And he makes a brutal mistake. He playmakers him. He's open, but throws off his back foot. And can you say, give me that one time. Let's go. Taylor Mays out of position. Linebacker comes up with the INT. And we are in field goal range, people. And that is going to be GG. He just quits out. He knows the game is over. And we take the second game against W. A great tournament player. Very good game. Very, very good game. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys hit that like button for some more wagers. Uh, and subscribe if you guys are new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.